ranting about things, even though I feel it's not my place to take everyone's attention or be filmed in some kind of <laughs> video, camera, phone, newfangled, new technology gizmo thing. You can describe the flavor of your pizza. Well, it starts off with a rather basic base of dough, yeast, that sort of thick flour, you know, that sort of thing. And then we put a coat of tomato, as you'll see there, a bit of tomato. Yes, they put the tomato. They make that out of three kinds of tomatoes. I know, we a tomato vine once in past life. And um, they use tin tomatoes, which of course don't go on vines, that's the ridiculous. Oh, yeah, the tin tomatoes. <laughs> yes. And then you have, you know, sun ripened tomatoes are the ones they leave outside. And then there's the kind of caged tomatoes. They're like caged chickens, only they're not alive. Well, they are alive, you know, and not alive in the same degree as chickens, it's not restricting their movement because tomatoes don't move very much. And then they add a bit of seasoning and they put them over this layer into a second layer on this cake, you see. And then I think the toppings on this particular pizza by Papa John, he made it himself, Papa John Schnetter, the founder of the company, they put Ham, pepperoni, which is of course, you know, foreign, foreign, yeah. foreign meat, peppers and seasons and what have you, in different flavors, and mushrooms, which inevitably are found around the back of the skip or around the back of their shop because it's so moldy and disgusting and smells shit. Anyway, and they also put some kind of cheese on it, although I have it on good authority. It's made of a cheese substitute, which they call mm, cheese. <laughs> it's, got a, it's got an almost silent M on the front, and only you can still hear it. And um, <laughs> they put that in an oven, or, um, well, yeah, they put it in an oven and heats it up, and so the cheese melts from the top and gives rather the you know, layered effect. It's rather nice for little bits of brown where it's been burnt a little bit. And then they take it outside and they get a fat person to sit on it, and that's what makes it so flat when you have pizza. But they also add this garlic sauce. Now, they don't even, they do call it special garlic sauce, and there is a reason for this. It's because they don't actually use garlic. Well, they do use a bit of garlic, but we never call it garlic sauce. But what they do is they throw some vinegar in it, gives it a bit more flavor. Then they tend to, well, depending on where you get it from, some sources are more reliable than others, they urinate <laughs> into it, and then they put it, put it in this rather nice container. And they don't tell you when you order the pizza for you. They assume that you're a student, you're not going to ask such questions, but it actually tastes a bit like shit, only with less nuts in it. And that's what it takes to make a Papa John's pizza. Thank you for listening. <laughs>